Hey gang, welcome to Inverted Pursuits Laboratory. And today we are out at KMK Ranch messing around in the horse pasture with a parafoil or air ram kite that we're actually looking at prototyping and modifying into um, our first like attempt at a guided parachute for a uh, larger model rocket like what Viper was or my level 2 rocket pointy end up. So we're calling this project Thump as we're just kind of looking initially here to thump the parachute up into the air and try and fly it back before we do a test flight on a rocket. So let's get started. All right, so we've removed the um, ribbons from the back, trying to see if those are causing issues with us getting this thing up in the air, but we're gonna give it another run. All right, you ready? No. You're kind of ready. Okay. All right, three, two, one, go. Okay, that made it wanna spin worse. Okay. Um, Well, I'm curious on that fact, so let's try, let's try something else. Try the streamers back on, and so there were two streamers per port, and now I've just changed it to just one, but I've tied the two streamers together, so they're twice the length. So we're going to give this a shot real quick and see what happens. All right. Oh, okay. Head out that way. Yeah. Cause notice how the wind's already grabbing it. Sorry, it was stuck on me. That's my fault. It is, but it won't hold any weight. No. These aren't designed for weight. Well, yeah. Because I am the captain now. Are you the captain now? Are you sure? Because I have all the shroud lines. Hey, 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 hey. Do you want me to get burned or yourself to get burned in the process? Nope, I'm good. Behave yourself. I am behaving myself. because if we find out that here let me give one more try at the see if i can get this on here now so when we pull it it's opening but it's only opening when we pull it which is the way a parachute should work but which is what we want but we can't simulate well, there's, that. there's no way to simulate that well which is getting very obnoxious but we need to get probably just a better actually build a proper airfoil parachute use thin shroud line like this. Line it up and tie it and throw it off the, the deck. Real quick. That's fair, let's do that. Just knot this around the handle wherever the point was that you were holding it. I need you to hold that right there. Sorry. <laughs> I can't do everything. Apologies. I got distracted by the camera. Ignore the camera. <laughs> got distracted by all the pretty people on the other side. You gotta grow your fan base somehow, babe. <laughs> they only moderately matter. <laughs> no offense, guys. <laughs> Ouch. That should be good. Alright, let's see if that does something real quick off the porch. Alright, you ready for this? I'm not. That worked beautifully, actually. Yes! It opened the wrong direction. I think by the time we actually get to the full stage of Project Thump, that might actually work. That's what there's a three time scale, this is what my next project was. Yeah, so like. scale it up three times. I just need to make some way for us to plop it into the air. Hang on. Uh, you got it a little tangled there.
It kind of worked. It did. It showed proper. Yeah. All right. Yeah. All right. Ready for a test drop? Do it. All right, here we go. Hey, it, it opened up the. Not the evening. Uh, I, I threw some footage in here of Kelsey working on this curtain for my house. Such a wonderful, wonderful seamstress she is. Um, but I rather like it, and I'm excited to have it over the uh, 1980s, 1990s style curtains that were in my house. Actually, yeah, let's run and grab those real quick. In comparison to those, yeah, I'm excited to have what I have over that. But with that, we're going to call it a night. Thanks for watching. Hopefully there will be more on Project Thumb coming up soon. And just, you know, random projects going on. Please consider subscribing. Have a good day.